honestly, guys, we're going out. Like, why are we wasting our youth? Why are we wasting our youth? Happy new vlog. Welcome to another week in the life. Today is Sunday. Heading to brunch in DC um, with the girls. As you can see, the girls and me. I wish I had more time to like curl my hair, but it is what it is. Our friend Lois is waiting for us inside. So we're just gonna go catch up with her. We're going to a restaurant called Uncaged Mimosas. Um, it's in Northwest DC. Mm, this is what the fit is looking like nothing too fancy and then after that there's like this concert that we want to go to so I'm gonna head over with some of the girls not everyone's coming um, but like gunning artists are gonna be there so I'm excited but I'll catch you guys when we get inside Happy new day. Today is Monday. Start of a whole new week. Just made it to the clinic. Um, I got here on like 8.55 a.m. Clinic starts at 9, but it's like 9.10. And the manager's now here, so I'm about to head in. Hopefully today's shift goes by fast. I'm going to be here from 9 to 5. And I see patients walking in already. <laughs> Can't not wait to be done with school, you guys. But anyways, guys, I'm here. I might check in with you guys later today. I'm also picking up my friend who's visiting me from London. Um, she flew in yesterday to New York, and she's coming to D.C. today. So I'm going to go pick her up in a little bit. So I need to, like, you know, make sure my house looks good for my guest. Um, I'm actually a little pissed because I ordered some things from Amazon, and it's not here yet, which is super annoying. But I might check in with you guys a little later. Checking in post clinic today. Time right now is 6.30 p.m. Guess what I'm up to, y'all? I'm in the bedroom. I'm in my bedroom right now. This is where I have been sleeping. A hot mess. I bought a new mattress that I'm trying to put together. Let me turn the camera. But basically, this is where I've been sleeping, guys. This is the before. Um, I bought a new mattress and I'm, I'm putting together. Um, after I set this up, I'm going to tell you guys where I got most of the things from um, that are in my bedroom right now. But yeah, let's go ahead and crack this mattress open. I got this from Amazon, by the way. The box mattresses for now. This is this will do. But I almost thought it wouldn't be here on time. But I got here, so I'm so happy. Basically, this is a box mattress it should fully inflate in like about two days so well, i'm gonna sleep on it tonight i don't care <laughs> but the moment i undo this guys it's gonna blow up Ugh, why am i making my job so hard oh my god i almost died <laughs> I almost just died. Wow. Chow. Y'all, the devil almost took my life. Oh. So basically, it looks like it's fully inflated, to be honest. But, y'all, that was a lot. But I'm topping it off with my foam mattress, y'all. This foam is so soft. I stole this from my sister a really long time ago and I have not returned it. I don't know where she got it from, but it's literally the most comfortable um, bed topper I've ever experienced. But I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the bed and then make the bed. is from Crate and Barrel. You guys, I love this bed so much. I love the quality of this. It feels so good and I absolutely love it. 
Once again, it is from Crate and Barrel. And it just has this like detailed wood thingy on the bottom here, which I really like. But yeah, that's what the bed is giving. And then my nightstand is from Crate and Barrel as well. I need to get another one to put another side. But y'all, this is a little expansive. <laughs> so, you know, we're doing things in moderation, but I definitely wanted to see the feel of it. But I definitely need to buy one more um, from Crate and Barrel. And I love the drawers. I'm keeping some things in there, but it kind of just like, pulls out like that. And it's just this really unique shape that you don't usually see um, with other nightstands. So I absolutely love it. And I love the color. I wanted the theme in here to be like mid-century modern. And so far, I like how what it's giving. Um, as you can see, my dresser is identical to the nightstand because they're in the same family. But this right here is the dresser. It's also from Crate Barrel. Great, great quality, you guys. And this is where I put like my clothes, like my t-shirts and stuff, but clearly not enough room. So, <laughs> but yeah, this is where I put like some of my clothes. This wood woodwork is just impeccable. Crate and Barrel, like you can never go wrong with it. And then I topped it off with this vase that I think I got from Ross. Yeah, Ross for like $12. And then my pumpkin grass is from Etsy. I would not recommend this because it sheds so much, y'all. It sheds a ton, so don't want y'all to waste your money on that. <laughs> and then moving on is my full-length mirror that I bought from, I believe, Ross as well. Ross sometimes has some like really good deals, but it just gives you a nice overview of my entire bedroom, and I absolutely love it. But yeah, I love this color as well. Once again, we're sticking to like the light wood finishes it matches the bed which i absolutely love but yeah so this is what the bedroom is giving i definitely need one more nice stand right here and then guys my window so i'm currently waiting for my drapings to come i'm getting custom drapings in here and it's gonna be like the hotel style ones if you guys know what i'm talking about like you kind of pull it you know one of those Whenever they get it installed, they said early August, so I'm hoping they push it up a little bit for me, but I've been sleeping in this room with no window, guys, and my view is of the golf course, which I'm just so, so excited about. I literally love waking up, y'all, just like walking out here, looking at the window, looking at the grass and the sky, and I'm just, I just feel so blessed, blessed, feel so blessed. Um, that's the best word I can use to describe my experience being here um that is good so yeah that is the bedroom for now you know there's a lot more to do i'm going to go pick up my friend from dc so i'm gonna go pick her up her bedroom let me show y'all where she's gonna be staying one of my guest rooms which is over here right here is the guest room that she's gonna be staying in and if you guys remember this the bed this used to be my old bed from my apartment my old dresser from my apartment and there's just a lot more to do here but for now you know this will do we have a functioning bed although the view of my room is nice y'all this is the view from this bedroom the water is right there and it's literally just so stunning another great view um, from the house let me get up and get up but so this is gonna be her room when she comes there's just some hangers in the closet and yeah basic necessities I definitely need a new dresser guys don't look at that <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to pick her up in about 30 to 45 minutes. So I'll probably check in with you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Happy new day. Today is Tuesday. I went to pick up my friend yesterday. So she's here. You guys will see her in a little bit. We're about to go get Chick-fil-A because am I a good American if I don't introduce you to Chick-fil-A? No, I'm not. So we're going to go to Chick-fil-A, the best food on the planet Earth. And then we're going to go to the mall because she needs to get something. But I want to quickly show you guys this amazing dress that everybody's been hyping on Amazon. So this is the infamous Amazon dress, guys, that everybody is wearing. It literally hooks your body so perfectly. And it's like really nice material. So it's not see-through at all. Like y'all can't see under my underwear, nor can you see like even the outline of my bra. Like, it's so cute. I'm going to link it in the box below. This is literally like your perfect everyday chill, go run errands kind of dress. So I'm going to go ahead and link it. But y'all, I bought this in uh, black as well. But I think I need to go back and get like a brown because that's that color is also really popular. I also bought this mouse because I feel like I'm going to be more productive if I'm able to like use a mouse <laughs> with my laptop. 
So let me test this out and see. I got this from Amazon. Um, if it works well, I'm going to link it in the description box below as well, along with a bunch of the other links I'm talking about. But let's see how compatible this is. All right. Looking real vacation-y. I know, right? I love it. I'm on As you should. I want to say hi. Oh! Thank you, Catherine. Hey. Please give us some British accent. Okay, so it's a pleasure to be here <laughs> <laughs> in my good sister's home. Oh, thank what? you for visiting. Thank you for she brings me, brings me tea. tea. British tea. British tea. Yeah. Y'all know I've been trying to drink more tea and like my sis came through. Thank you so much. Welcome. I saw this one. I was like, yes. yes. It's really like, giving. Oh, you brought me some walkers, friend. <laughs> Oh, do you like it? It's popular. Oh, no. <laughs> I think it's maybe like a Ghanaian thing, but oh, okay. whoa, thank you so you much. You're welcome, love. All right. Aww. 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 Guys, <laughs> thank you so much. You're welcome. Tea. Cheers. We just got back from Chick-fil-A, guys. We're at the mall. Let me not get copyrighted. Um, we just got to the mall. We're gonna go buy some Crocs and yeah. whatever else. Whatever else God tells us to get. So full. Thanks, yeah. Michelle. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> no, no, rate right Chick fil A on a scale of zero to 10. Oh zero is like mm, mm, terrible food. 10 is like good breakfast food. So the fact that I'm full is good mm. and it's filling, and I feel like the sauce did it for me. I'm sorry. Really? I, I, know I didn't eat all the sauce. So you don't really? I just ate oh it. Oh my gosh. I love it. Yeah. I, I really rate it. I can't rate it. Like, I love it. I don't know. 10 out of 10. Good. I mean, okay. It's good. It's good. It's really good. I'm it's glad. Really good. I'm glad. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. I'll check in with y'all a little later. Back from the mall, guys. I'm about to cook. I told y'all we're cooking this year. Okay, we're not playing. So today I am making um, salmon pasta. I'm not really sure what it's called, but it's really good. I'm just going to go ahead and start off by boiling my um, pasta. We're using this is what? Any peen, any type pasta shells. And then we're gonna add the salmon and all that fun stuff. Do you know what this is called? This is called, yeah, pen. peen. Peen. <laughs> peen. Peen pasta, there we go. Oh, Jesus. Pasta. Okay, pasta. Period. Wow. <laughs> Let's begin. Let's begin. <laughs> hey, sister. Hey, my love. <laughs> we are about to go eat some food. I'm about to curl my hair. My She's like all done, and I'm like a mess. Um, oh, I need to give you the perfume. I also went to Sephora today and bought. Oh my gosh, I should have given you the setting spray. I bought the new. I'm so we can still use it. Still use it. We bought the new Patrick Star one it. size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm about to use it right now. Then again, mm. right now. <laughs> Go ahead. I got these mini sprays, which I absolutely love. Oh, this is so cute. Let me take this out of this box. Oh, <laughs> y'all. This is what the packaging looks like. We'll let y'all know if it's long lasting. We're gonna be in the heat, but not for long though. Hmm. Okay. Yes. 
Oh, I like this sound. <laughs> You're making me miss Ghana. So you guys are lucky. When y'all go to Ghana, you don't need to get an adapter. Oh my gosh, because when we go to Ghana, we have to buy one of these things, but I can't find my curler right now and I'm using Catherine's and her outlet is like the UK style ones, but luckily I got this, so we are gonna make it work. We are gonna make it work. Oh, you know what? It's not gonna work either because this is the Ghana adapter. So I need, I need, no, I need to go get yours. I have the one that that I use when I go to Ghana. I don't know why I thought it would work. Yeah. So this is what I'm talking about. So basically, I'm gonna attach that, plug it in. What did you say? No, I don't. Yes, ma'am, we're getting ready. Um, Harvester left. If you could go, that'd be great. Cause but we're gonna leave in like five minutes. Okay. Oh, okay. Harvester's not coming. No, she's coming. She's on her way. Oh, she's on her way going. Yeah. Okay. So let me go. Yeah. And I think Barilla too. She just texted me. Let me see. Okay. So if not, they're gonna cancel. I think. <laughs> this girl said I'm going to be 30 minutes late. But the only they only give you a 15 minutes grace period. I know, but we had a situation. Catherine wasn't feeling well, so we didn't know if we we're gonna go. Yeah, that's for us. Next time we're going to Kitchen Cocktail. Matze. Is that on a rooftop place too? It's not a rooftop, but it's like this new place that is in Dallas. Yeah, Dallas? It's in Dallas, but it's brought it to DC. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And then it's so nice. We're doing that the next date night. Yeah. No, honestly, guys, we're going out. Like, why are we wasting our youth? Why are we wasting our youth? Hmm. That'd be us and me. I'm gonna out. I'm gonna out. <laughs> I wonder how that guy's doing. I'm gonna out. I'm gonna out. <laughs> we outside for the summer period. I'm sorry. Even if it's just to dinner, my gosh. Hmm. I'm saying even if it's just to dinner, like it's something to That's do. What it should be. We should be going for dinner. Yeah. Yo, I was telling her, how do UK girls do their makeup? How do they do their makeup? Hey, darling. There's a difference. Oh, is there? Really? Oh my God. I was watching her apply her makeup, guys, and I was like, y'all need to teach me. Oh, too much. Can't wait to see you. I'm glad she's feeling better. Yeah, I'm feeling much better. Good. I will be wearing these earrings from, I think ASOS. Yeah, I think I got it from ASOS. Yeah, this is what we get. Maybe a little ring. I need to put lotion on my hands, child. I feel like I'm always so ashy. guys in the description box below such an easy everyday type of hair it's like a one of those like not a full lace frontal but the ones that in here but a link will be in the description box below this is what I'm wearing are the heels we are wearing yeah this is the outfit but you guys, I'm gonna meet up with the girls. I will see y'all in DC.
Good morning, happy new day. Y'all, sorry I had not checked in the last two days, Tuesday or was it the Wednesday, Thursday? Today's Friday. I got so sick. <laughs> I got so sick. Like I had chills. I don't have a thermometer, so I didn't check to see if I was febrile or not, but I had chills and I had a sore throat. Um, and I almost lost my voice on Thursday, but I've been drinking tea, which is what we're drinking this morning. Um, don't much, have much of an appetite, but I'm gonna take these almond butter biscuits to work. And yeah, I have not been feeling too great, so I couldn't go to the clinic yesterday. I had to like call out of the clinic, but I'm going today, I feel a lot better. I'm also gonna take some ibuprofen just in case, although I feel better. Um, yeah, I don't feel the chills anymore, so I don't think I have a fever. So yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy this tea really quickly, check my emails, and then head to work. My cousin Nana is coming over today, and tomorrow is really exciting. Um, but I think I might check in with you guys tomorrow. I just wanted to do a quick check-in to let y'all know that I'm alive and well, <laughs> that I'm okay. And yeah, I'll check in tomorrow, Saturday, an exciting day. I feel like I always got somewhere to be <laughs> uh, when I'm ending my vlogs, but I do. I'm going to um, one of my friend's baby showers or a baby gender reveal, let me say. Um, so yeah, I'm excited for that. I will check in with you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, checking in, happy Saturday. Currently getting ready to head to a baby shower. I am also using the Patrick Star, oh Lord Jesus. Okay, <laughs> the Patrick Star, what is it called, one size spray. Um, yes, last time I wore it, it was really good. I did not get oily at all, but let's see how it treats me today um i also want a lot more layers in my hair so i think i'm gonna go ahead and cut more layers so that's what we're gonna do and i'm gonna put some curls in my hair to head to this shower. so i'm gonna get real scissor happy oh this the scissors is blunt child real blunt i don't know where to go And then I want to put like more layers in here. I'm going to go ahead and curl the hair guys. Let's see how it turns out. I'll come back and show you guys what the layers look like. <laughs> That's your quote. I'll say, I'm so glad, Michelle, you came with us. <laughs> I said, I found kind of my makeup. I'm called Don Marco. I'm called anointed the whole room. They don't get caught. I got to do on that toilet. I got to do it in the whole room, Nick. <laughs> All right, guys. So this is what the layers did. Um, well, as always, like one side looks way better than the other. <laughs> but it is what it is. It is what it is. Um, I'm going to show you guys what the outfit is giving when I get back downstairs. But I want to do a quick BTT per usual before we go. Um... Today's BTT is going to be coming from numbers 2319. One of my favorite verses ever. That's what's keeping me. That's what's keeping me going. But numbers 2319 reads God is not a man that he should tell or act a lie, neither the Son of Man that he should feel repentance or compunction for what he has promised. Has he said, and shall he not do it? <laughs> has the Lord said, and shall he not do it? Or has he spoken, and shall he not make it good? That is the word of the Lord today. Numbers 23, 19. Whatever promise God has given you, 
regardless of what your circumstance is looking like girl i know it's hard to have faith because i have been there i am there but god is not a man that he should lie y'all i sound so nasty like i said i was a bit sick the past like couple of days recovering i took a covid test today i was negative so i feel comfortable going to this baby shower i do not have a fever either so yeah we better but i'm gonna go finish putting on my outfit guys and i'll show y'all what we're giving with the fit all right guys so this is the outfit um just a brown dress with like rusions on the side there no i went clear heels it is so windy outside it's about to thunderstorm but i gotta go support my girl so we're going anyways I sound terrible, but my COVID test was negative, so we're not we're not contagious, I don't think. <laughs> Thanks, guys, let's head to the baby shower. So excited for my girl. Come on, let's go. We really about to do what we came here to do, right? Are your cameras ready? Are the drones ready? made it home tonight was so much fun congratulations to the parents um, i'm gonna end the vlog here guys i'll check in with y'all in next week's video your girl's going to sleep i took my makeup off did my skincare yeah but thank you guys so much for watching see y'all next time